Oh, hi, Bedrock. How are you doing today? Are you doing good? I hope you're doing good because I have worms for you. You ate that. Good job. Boom, 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 boom. Guys, can you believe Stone Block 2 is finally here? Guys, I am so freaking excited. I can't wait to get started and check it out. We have a cool pet rock. And, oh, oh, hi, Mr. Pet Rocco. How are you doing? You're tamer. What? Tamer. How do I tame you? Do you want some, uh, some, some stonium? Oh, you do. Oh, we have a pet rock. It's our best friend forever. So he's a smiley face, and then he has, like, a munchy face. Smile and munchie. Okay. So in the old one, oh, hold up. I think we have a quest book here. Ooh, it's changed. It is nifty as I'll get out. We need to gather some of these. Okay, so we're using the new questing thing. We use this on one of the newer FTB packs, which is fun. All right, so we need to get 16 stone pebbles. So I'm going to go ahead. I believe if you just punch this, you get pebbles, right? Yeah, we already got four. Check that out. All right, so I'm going to punch some stuff, and we're going to have some fun. All right, so as you can see, I got a little bit more than 16 like we needed. Uh, and our little, our little pet rock was looking at us the whole time. It was pretty cool. He was smiling. So, but anyway, we got a quest complete. So let's go ahead and complete it here. Um, so click this. Okay, so you just click that. Ooh, look at that. We got storage upgrades. That's amazing. All right, so what is the next quest? Make cobblestone. So we need to make 12 cobblestone. I believe if we just go with that, it's one. Okay, so we got four. Um... Where can we here? Let's move the torch. Ooh, so dark. So dark and spooky. Hey, Mr. Pet Rock, you're glowing. Alright, so I don't want to go for a big giant base like we did in Stone Block 1. I want to go ahead and have one that's kind of intricate, almost like a, it feels like a cave, if that makes any sense. Seen a few YouTubers do it and I like the feel. Uh, I haven't liked how they've done it. I think if I do it my way, oh, rip. I think if I do it my way, I could do it a little bit better. So um, we'll see how that goes. So here, okay, where are those going? They're going there. Okay, that is perfectly fine. All right, so I'm gonna keep doing this and I'll be back when I think I have enough. All right, we should have enough now. We have 48 made, yeah, so we easily got that one. Perfect, let's go ahead. We're gonna zoom in a little bit over here. Let's go ahead and claim this reward. And, oh, we got an Invar hammer. That is amazingly awesome. Okay, so next we're going to need to go ahead... That's interesting. Cobblestone chest. Okay, so let's see about making that. Cobblestone chesticle. Here you are. What are you? Cobblestone part? Okay. Oh, so we're probably going to need to make that crafting table first if we're going to need to make that. Okay, so let's look up a stone crafting table. Like you. Hello there. Ta-da! You made. Um, Mr. Pet Rock, can you move over there? I like your hat, by the way. I think it looks amazing. Sorry for the darkness, guys. And ta-da. Hey, we have light. We, we are very lit in here. So, okay, so in order to make that cobblestone chesticle, we're going to need to craft this up, which I believe we have enough. We do. All right, so you, oh, it's just like a normal chest, perfect. And I believe I got two quests now to get. I do, random reward. We got a garden cloche already. And a drop of evil? Whoa, that's amazing. Those will be, you have no idea how, how useful those are gonna be. So here's a mob farm and then here we can make the cool things. If that, makes, that didn't make any sense. Oh well, just, just take my word for it. Okay, so we have that quest done. So now we're going to make it the dirteth. So what we're going to need to do is grab our stone. Can you make sticks out of these? You can. I wonder, are we able to make stone hammer? We are. Ta-da. Okay, so how much dirt do we need to make here? How much do you want? Do you want just one? Okay, that's easy. So I believe it goes... We'll go to gravel now, yep, and then one more will go to dirt. Yep, just like the normal. Okay, so it's pretty much this normal stone block. We're basically just starting over. Okay, so we got that done. Stone crook. 
That should be pretty easy to make. <gasps> I was wrong. How do you make a stone crook? Stone crook. How do I make it view it? Oh, oh snap. I feel stupid. Okay, less stupid. <laughs> I just do that very quickly. Okay, you're done, Ski. And here we go. Oh, climbing glove. I just, I'd love, I'd love it to bits. Is this the one where you just like walk? Oh, oh boy. Yeah, that's smart. I'm going to die from that once or twice. Trust me. Okay, so you can get out of there. And let's see. So gathering wood. Okay, so now that we have... When did I get this cobblestone generator? Does anybody remember me getting this cobblestone generator? Was it from the crook? Maybe? I don't know. Okay, so why did we craft up? You can be used on dirt. Oh, okay. So let's try it out. Would you would you just look at it? That's amazing. I didn't know that was in the pack. The vein miner? We do. Oh, there's a conflict. Oh, do we have the morph mod? I think we do, guys. I'm so excited. Sorry. Sorry, my voice got a little weird there. I'm just, I, I love it. I'll need to, to redo that key off camera. Because that was simply not to do. And we got a jungle. Okay, so we still need some more. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not that mad at you. Not that mad at you. Oops. I would like an oak one. Is that an oak? Yeah, okay, we got an oak. Perfect. Invarit. That's going to be dangerous in a little bit. Grab. I just auto jump. No, I climbed. Okay, so. Oh, Pet, Mr. Pet Rock, what are you doing? What are you doing? We're going to put that plus there, so if any mobs spawn on the other side of that, they can't get over to us. The only ones that can are baby zombies, and those are scary. But we'll just we'll just die. A death of deaths, called potatoes, and we'll be good. Okay. Okay, so we got some dirt now, which is good. Um, Alright, we're actually... We need to grow a tree really bad. Okay, so we're going to kind of punch this out here. I'm going to build a little room here so we can put a tree in. I will be right back. It's going to get dark though, which is going to be kind of scary. All right, so we've got a room over here and it's pretty dark. I, I'm not 100% sure if this is going to grow in such a dark room. Um, I'm pretty sure the light does affect these, but if you, we can do this twerking thing here. Oh, it did grow. Perfect. And we've got some more saplings. Cool. And we're going to get some oak wood. Amazing. And was that the quest? How much wood do we need? 16. Okay, so I got four. What we're going to go ahead and do is make a furnace. Like so. I'll place you here, and then we're going to go like this. Like so. And this will make up coal, so we can make some torches. Okay, so we got two charcoal here. So let's go ahead and make some of these stone guys and we will put these in the corners here and it's plenty lit for me anyway and we'll just place one in here maybe one where this guy is okay and i'm gonna oh we're out of that okay so now we got light we don't have to worry about dying okay so what if i make another stone chest how did I make the other one? How do you make the cobblestone chest again? Because what I'm wondering is... Oops, whoops, 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 whoops. There we go. Does this work like this? Because you put an inventory up above of it. Oh, it does work. Check it out. So now we're automate. We already got auto cobblestone. So what it does is it looks for an inventory space up above it, and then it it'll place it in there. So that is that is fantastic. Place you here. We're going to need to twerk a few times. All right, so now we have a total of 17. We have gone ahead and unlocked this quest. Oh my gosh, we just got two ender tanks. I love this questing thing. And we have like a heck ton of saplings now. We even got some more food, so we can just eat up whenever we want. Hold up. If we cook 
apples. I want to see if this still works. We get the cooked apples. These are really good. This is what I ended up using in Stoneblock for those of you who are joining us for the first time. Yes. Okay, so if we look at the the stats of the normal apple, you can see it's half of a hunger bar and half of a saturation bar. But this is four and I believe it's six. So these are clearly a heck ton better. And so we're going to be using the heck out of these. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is probably punch out all of these walls here, move this dirt block back, and make a little dirt section area. Uh, but now we can get into... Okay, first of all, we can... Let's go ahead and twerk this up. Do I have any silkworms on me? I do. We got 22. Plus, silkworms you can also eat for food as well, just in case things get lean and we need to go ahead and uh, eat them. You can just cook them up and then you can eat them just fine. You can eat them only. Oh, uh, you're not being fun. Please grow. I command you to grow. Okay, I ain't CT Fletcher, so that ain't gonna work. Oh, well. Let's see. Double click action. Hey, look at that. It worked. Okay, so our go. Oops. Gonna have to break one of you. Okay, so our goal here is to place these silkworms. And we will get silky leaves or something like that. And let's go like this. Just place these all around. These will infect the other leaves. But doing this will make it go by a lot quicker. Okay, 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 okay. I think we got them all. Yeah, this is going to be really bad. I keep, I'm keep. i going to hurt myself a lot. Okay, so while that's going, let's go ahead and start on the tinker stuff. Uh, we're going to go ahead and save one oak log for one tool. I'm going to go ahead and go like this, get some sticks out of this. Okay. And so it probably wants us to make a bunch of this stuff. Yeah, so let's get the recipe for this. That should be okay for what we need. All right, so at Tinkers. All right, so this is Tinkers. It's pretty cool. Uh, if you are new to this, this might be a little bit confusing, so I'll try to explain it as much as I can while I go. Uh, we're going to need a stencil table, which is just like this. Use the blank pattern, a piece of wood. Um, let's see here. There's a lot of different woods. Holy crap. We're going to need a part builder. That's the little table. Okay, so that's what that one oak wood was left for. It was a part builder. Okay, and then we're probably going to need to make a crafting table like so. Put it here. Put this above to get a tool station, which we will later upgrade with some iron. And another block that we haven't gotten to yet. And a pattern chest will need a chesticle. Okay, like so. And then we will put one of these above and make a pattern chest. Okay, so this should have... Yep, we unlocked it. Perfect. Yep, we did all four. So let's go ahead and click OK. And what did we get? Two ender... Oh my gosh, this is amazing! Oh, hi, Bedrock. How are you doing today? Are you doing good? I hope you're doing good because I have worms for you. You ate that. Good job. Okay, you did. <laughs> All right, so next in our quest of book, oh, actually, we need to place these down. So we'll do stencil table because that's always first. Put the blank patterns in here. Then we do the park builder. Uh, and then... Okay, I don't know if it can do diagonal, but it'll look good. Okay, it doesn't do diagonal, unfortunately, but it'll look okay. And this is how we make our pickaxe, shovel, stuff like that. So this will be this will be really good for early game. Um, okay, so after Tinkers, the string. So we have the silkworm, but we need one string. That's it. That is really it. Okay. Four. We'll get a crook out because... Oh, I had a crook on me. Son of a nutcracker, dudes. Okay, Silky Road... I'm not mistaken, that is the morph mod, this thing here. I could be mistaken, please let me know. If you guys know down in the comment section, please do let me know. I would love, I would love to know. We got two more ender chests. Now we have a total of four. We are amazing. Okay. And we got this one. Wait. Did I already claim that? I think I did it. The tool forge won't be able to do that just yet. Um, uh, a visit mining dimension. Ooh, I don't know if we can do that just yet. We're going to go ahead and do this, make a sieve. 
Um, so let's see here. I believe, actually, no, I believe. Is it like that? No, that might be, oh, that, okay, that stayed in there. That's cool. I believe it's a half slab, actually, in the middle. Let's see here. Yep, that's it. Okay. And then we'll use the string to make string mesh. And if you go like this, you put a sieve here. You place that there, you made, made a, a good sieve. And what that is used for is sit. Oh my gosh, did we really just get an ME drive? That's amazing. So let's see. If we're going to take a little bit of cobblestone, we're going to go ahead and place it like this. Okay, Mr. Petrock, you might need to move, buddy. If I make you a face like that, will you not move? Maybe. And if you come over here, okay. Back to this. If we come over here with the gravel, and you right click, it will basically, it's like you're almost sifting it and you'll get materials. So like lead ore pieces, iron ore pieces, coal. We, now we have coal and this has a chance of dropping diamonds and I do believe emeralds. I'm not 100% sure. I could check, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> so you guys tell me if I'm wrong down in the comment section because I know you will. All right, so we'll just sift the rest of these and we'll see what we get. We didn't even, oh, we didn't get anything from that. Okay, so we got one iron ore piece, lead. We got some tin. Uh, we have a plump pair. I don't think we got it from that, but that's what we're going to be using for that. Peak efficiency, so it needs a heavy oak sieve. Okay. Let's go ahead and twerk you up. And boom, you're grown. That's cool. Why don't you give me some of your leaves and meats and things. And I don't know where I was going with that, but who cares? Okay, so now that we have the heavy oak sieve, let's go ahead. Heavy oak sieve, right there. Okay, jungle, there you are. And we got it, perfect. Click on that. Oh boy, chance cubes, my favorite thing ever. They're actually, I actually really do enjoy chance cubes, but we're not gonna be using that today because I do like this world and I would like to keep it for more than five minutes. And if we use that, we probably won't keep it for more than five minutes. So, yeah. Let's go here. We'll make another... Make another stone chesticle. And we can put it right here. We'll put all our stuff in there. And we are good to go. Check it out. We got some cooked apples. Apples. Okay. So guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap up the episode for today. If you did enjoy the episode, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe because we will be going into this series in so much depth. We're going to hammer out as many episodes as we can because I am excited to play Stone Block 2. But anyways, guys, I hope you have a great and fantastic day. I will see you next episode. Peace out. Bye-bye.